Hi guys. After my yesterday's scarcity and feeling being hit <laughs> by uh, bad news, I'm okay again. That's life, you know. We're always going to be challenged. And since I know this for sure, that this is how life is, this is how growth happens, this is how evolution continues. You need challenges and it's comfort for me that it is okay this way that we're always going to be challenged and we can take it as a bad thing label it as a problem struggle or we can make it just normal accept it and say like it's a task a new opportunity the next thing to do but i like the word challenge because it doesn't mean anything bad to me means sometimes even exciting something new to take on and solve or overcome and get stronger since i know this it's comfort for me that it's okay it's also confirmed for myself that i like changes because it means growth to me without changes there no growth and for that i just heard a really nice statement which uh, i haven't heard before not in this way i'm watching the monthly webinar in the business i am in the community i am in you can hear golden nuggets one way is to be challenged in a good way <laughs> if you take it so take it in a good way or forced to change and growth it's to is to get out of your comfort zone how do you do that? Do something you know you want to do. It can be an action to move towards the thing you want. But somehow just postpone it or even procrastinate about it. Because it, it's scary. It is. That's the main feature of it. It is really scary. And... Deep down, you know you want it, but on the surface, you feel like, no, no way, no way. I'm not going that way. And that's probably after can cause a really uncomfortable situation. Confusion, because there's deep down you want something. At the same time, your mind and your common sense say, no, don't do that because, because of this and that. Even you can get excuses and explain why it's no good. And you know, that other thing is really hard for me. Sometimes it's hard to differentiate what exactly I really want. And I'm not doing it because of my mind says that no, no. Or something I don't want at all. I know it doesn't make sense what I said now because how could I not know that? But sometimes it's not that easy to know. So the golden nugget I heard was about the getting out of comfort zone. Life starts when you get out of your comfort zone. Yeah, that made new sense. We tend to, even if we know this, all these things, we need want to change and grow. We just tend to get comfortable and then just procrastinate and, and not do the things we know we should for, for growth. But sometimes you just need this kind of motivation inspiration and just help someone just kick you in the ass so to speak in order to start or continue moving forward again and so many times especially with this video for me was a really a big uncomfortable situation it's not just be in the camera but talk about things i knew i wanted to but normally people don't talk about I believe that those things we, we're scared of talking about carry the, the biggest value and, and even information can gain interest from people we want to get interest. For me, as being an internal marketer, finding my way, my purpose and my brand. Yes, because what I learned is to be authentic and how you can be authentic when know what your heart says that's not just being authentic but being self-aware know what 
exactly our heart says and act the way the heart says and sometimes it's hard because so many times what the heart says to do it is out of the comfort zone saying things doing things i believe building a business any type of business it's hard because of that a viable successful business should be based on authenticity and towards the journey will be really uncomfortable i don't know why maybe because of the the way we grew up the society norms somehow we are not trained this to be normal not natural for us to see and just naturally go through this process we have to learn accept and go into it and it's painful trust me if you you know what i'm talking about when saying it's painful to be out of the comfort zone then you haven't been there i would suggest to do so because even though it's painful when once you get with the results with the thing you wanted and finally you just started your journey and went through the little pains and get out of the other side to gaining those little wins you know it, it was worth it <laughs> yep and this is what i'm looking for so after this hearing this golden nugget i was um thinking again what my next step should be to get out of the comfort zone and push myself do more changes do things i wouldn't do normally because that's changed today i didn't go to work because nothing for me to do but from tomorrow and i really hope because i've been counting all the money again i know planning and it makes me worry how much i should make in order to come out of the month and now all this cutting down the benefits and uh, it's like right now there is nothing this is the already recalculating the result of the tax renewal and i'm really not proud of getting all these things because my my dream is just to be so sufficient anyhow but it comes really good this help and i know one day i will pay it back i mean you know with my tax i earn once i earn more i will pay more tax i like to do, get my own money i don't like to be reliant on anyone else i know the times will come i love nature i'm so happy that it's summer should always do record videos outside so i came to the leisure center one of those i signed up with and then i got a session like um introduction about my goals it was interesting because i just came and okay i looked like i didn't know what i wanted and then the guy was waiting for me to say something and then i wasn't sure what exactly they offer so what i can say so i showed a picture what i want to look like <laughs> something similar and then that was quite a good offer i got how i should do diet which already i started which is good and then i need to do like intervals uh, trainings like high intervals like like half an hour non-stop or 20 minutes non-stop something fast sprint something uh, fast and and strong and then stop start again something like that so i will be curious how i can do that but he showed me his pictures how he looked he used to look that's you know along with his knowledge it seemed that he's um, someone who knows what he's talking about enough uh, validation confirmation that enough for me who knows and they said that's for free is including in the membership which is really good and the other thing i prepared for swim after that and then is um swim lessons so there's no availability here so i have to go to the other center so i do that 
and then I come back Thursday and then I'm gonna have a session with this guy he said he would work train with me that's really good so we'll do it together I'm really curious how I'm going to manage that Let's see how that goes